All right, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Spice and Wolf episode 10. In the last episode, Lawrence and Hollow were kind of fully made it to the city. Uh, they're on the way to uh, kind of sell the armor when they found out that the debt that they owed for the armor, which they were going to pay back, was transferred to the merchants within the city. Uh, they found out that the war kind of, whatever it's called, the war advancement, something like that, was cancelled, which meant the price of armor drastically dropped in price, which means he was screwed over. Uh, so now Kraft's kind of freaking out, trying to sell his armor somewhere or be lent some money to kind of fix the situation, but no one's able to help him. Um, he's now kind of gone off on hollow. She's walked away as well, and now it's really not looking good for him. So I hope um, the kind of Hollow and Lawrence are able to kind of reconcile in this episode and hopefully figure out a plan to get rid of this armor and get the money back. But yeah, as always guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh jeez, having to beg like this sucks. It's Hollow here. Oh, she's in bed. Oh. Yeah, she's kind of rightfully pissed at him right now. He's going through it, but he didn't need to go off on her like that. Hollow, Hollow can help the situation. She'll figure something out. Yeah, she launched that at him. <laughs> Get inside. I'm locking these damn doors. Begging his ass off. Oh, he cares about her like that. He's a fool, though. Was it? Was it not just that one instance, though, that she, like she was the she was off fault for being there? Oh shit! Oh my god! <gasps> Jesus! Y'all need to figure out a plan to get one over on this damn city, this damn merchant. They uh, fucked you over right now. And they need to tell the people of the previous city that they're being scammed by the merchant guy of the wonky table. Oh. They're really good for each other. <laughs> Why is he such a good person? <laughs> Did that piss her off? Oh, shit. <laughs> A full-on punch. <laughs> She's so funny. <laughs> she gonna beat your ass. Yeah, he's not like that, though. <laughs> yeah, you want him to say it now? Because of my personality. Okay. <laughs> That's it. Now she's gonna fix your problem. Let's go. Or maybe he's gonna fix it himself. Maybe he, need, he just needed the resolve and the hook from the right. Wolf girl. I still think Nora's gonna play a part in this in some way. I hope so. She seems like a nice character. <laughs> yes! Let's go, Hollow. Let's see what you got. Alright, let's see the play. Who's this guy? Is this the guy you use money to? This seems too convenient. Oh, okay. Interesting. Oh, Nora. That's crazy. Risking a lot here. Oh. Okay. Oh shit, they're struggling too. Okay. I got this man dead to rights. Let's go. What's the play though? I don't get it. I never do until it happens though with this show. 
conning a young, young woman. Hopefully Nora profits from this as well. Yeah, she was helpful though. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, God must have brought you together. <laughs> Is she going to be drinking as well? She said she can't drink much. That's a lot. So she's going to be smuggling gold at the same time? How? This is going to completely change her life if she can do it. Maybe that would benefit her because she's not getting any work here? Yeah. They do be keeping an eye on her. It definitely would be best for you to leave the city. Oh shit. Those are some drastic words. He did say the church here, though. He didn't insult the, the whole church as an organization. Nobody would ever suspect a shepherd. Isn't that going to be too heavy for them? How much gold is it? The Pagan's Hound. Oh, shit. This sounds like a good plan. Will she be, con be convinced by this? Okay, Nora, let's go. Hollow sense or something. I think. Mm, he is putting her in danger here. Oh my god, look at where she's living. <laughs> You're not too bad yourself, yeah. <laughs> she wouldn't, uh... <laughs> she's so into this man. Too good-natured. <laughs> All she wants is for you to be with her, and that's it. Right, so that was Spice and Wolf episode 10. Another very good episode there. I knew Hollow would kind of come up with a plan for this. Um, I do like that Nora is uh, kind of being used in this situation as well. Not necessarily used, kind of used, but they don't mean any ill will on her. She's a good person. They want her to make some money from this as well. Um, it's going to be interesting to see how well this plan actually works out. Strapping gold to the bellies of sheep. Um, I mean, I don't know how much they're transporting, but surely that's that could cause some issues. But I guess nobody would su would suspect um, just a shepherd moving a sheep, especially one like her. Um, but yeah, I guess we'll see how it's going to go. I'm uh, very much looking forward to the next episode. So as always, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction today. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.